y'all, this man is really out here with this baby carrier. Stop. He's excited. So what? Are you excited? Yes, I am. I'm practicing. Are you happy? Yes, I am. Can't do it Look, he had it camera. on wrong. He didn't even have this fastened. I had to fasten it for him. Who, who can reach back there and fasten something they sell? Like you didn't that? even know it was a buckle right I there. I didn't. <laughs> like, I just tightened up the arm straps. Exactly. You had it under your pits. Let me see if this thing. Yeah, Ow! Uh, you sorry. hurt my nose. Oh, I'm editing that out because that's a mean word. Guys, don't say mean words. The sky is pretty. Yeah. Our neighborhood is trash though. Like, <sighs> y'all, give me some followers. This is throwing trash. Don't and that's exactly what I was. Because, give me some followers so we can get some money so I can get out, out this hood. <laughs> this ain't even the hood, but it's just, it's just trash, y'all. She's going in a circle. I don't know. I wasn't paying attention to nobody. But. I just want a better life for my children. I don't even live in a neighborhood and go out fishing in our lakes. <laughs> like, what? But yeah, y'all see this? All these broke ass blinds. Like, that's, that's, that's sad. But yeah, I'm ready to get some money not from youtube though like we got other stuff going on we got uh you know we into acting we what's hanging in the tree leaves brown leaves yeah um we into acting we into we got a new radio is that our car <laughs> we got a new radio um show going on about to start after we drop the baby but we already having like pre-shows and stuff and it's called FYRG. That's F your relationship goals. And we talk about some pretty lit stuff. Like today's show was like lit. Like I low-key wish it was like a real one because it was pretty dope, don't you say? Don't it you was. think? Today was actually a great show today. Yep. I can see us now. Oh, by the way, this bear is baby K's bear. And yeah. her name is Kalea. Yeah. So we named her Kalea. We made Kalea. her at Build a Bear. This is little Kalea if you guys want to meet her. He got a poop or something? I don't know. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so we got we got acting going on. We got the FYRG radio going on. We got Damo's clothing line. Um, we're in the works of getting some more stuff going for that because we've been slacking on that, you know. But he's getting on that. Um, I need to get into more painting because I do want to do more art, but I just feel like I've been doing so much. <laughs> what are you doing? See, this is baby Kalea. That's Kalea. But like, I haven't been doing art because every day I'm just doing stuff, getting ready for the baby. So I haven't been able to paint. I haven't been able to edit as much as I want. Get him out of there. Cause that has nothing but poop. Oh yeah. And then our neighborhood is filled with like geese. And all they do is like poop in this lake and it's not filtered or nothing. So it's just dirty. They got the rocks is not where the rocks is supposed to be. And it just, it's just terrible, you guys. And then our pool still hasn't opened. It is officially the real summer. Like it's July, it's, it's June 20, what? Fourth. And they still haven't opened the pool. So like, and every time I tell Dominique, go check, go check. They're like, next week, next week, next week. I probably was stepping in poop. I'm mad. I should have been looking. But, yeah. Um, what was I talking about? Oh, yeah, what we had going on. What else do we have going on? That's pretty much it. That's pretty much it. Like, I just graduated school, and I do want to get into a job in that in that field. But not really. Like, that's not my dreams. Like... The whole time that I was in college, I kept switching my um, my my major, thinking that I would find a better one for me. 
and psychology is nice because I do like talking to people but I don't I'm gonna have to go back and get a master's and then go through all that and I don't think I really want to be a therapist I just think that I want to get to know people on a personal level shut the fuck up that's the other bad thing about living in apartments like no. dogs just be barking and I don't, I, I literally, I just have a problem when dogs bark and their, um, their people don't say nothing to them and they just let them bark for hours. Like that, that don't annoy you living with that. Cause my dog don't bark, but when I lived with my mom and our dog barked, I would just be like, shut up and he'll be quiet. <laughs> I don't get why people don't just tell their dog to shut up. Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. Mm -hmm. I'm just talking. Cause this dog better not bark. Yeah. He only barks when you blow in his face. Yeah, he don't like that. <laughs> Are you blowing his face? I go, he'll go like this, and he'll go, and then he'll sit down and go, what's wrong with you? Yeah, but, that's what we got going on. And people be asking me about college and stuff. Like adults. They be like, so what's your plans? And I, that's the worst question you could ever ask me. Because I don't have a plan. Literally, even when I was going to college, I didn't plan to go to college until it was time to go. Like, <laughs> I didn't. That's why I went to the school I went to. And it was so close to home is because I didn't plan. I just, I just go with the flow. And like... Whatever I feel like God is telling me to do at that moment, I do. I do. Unless he tells me to leave a nigga, that's the hardest thing to do. No, I'm just kidding. No, I'm serious. Anyways, look at this cat. Yeah, that's the that cat that he, um, that he tried to run up on that wasn't having no smoke. Y'all, this cat is just sitting here. We got so many stray cats. Like, this cat is just sitting here. No. You think I should add this? Because, okay, we have our baby shower vlog we need to upload. And we have, like, getting ready for the baby stuff that I want to upload. Should I add this to that? Or should I make this, like, a whole vlog walking around the neighborhood? Just a vlog walking around the neighborhood. Walking around the neighborhood? Okay. So, yeah, this is going to be a walking around the neighborhood vlog. Uh, ooh, I'm just trying to get this baby out. And I feel like walking will help. It's supposed to help. They said, um, baby, um, to get the baby out is stuff you can do. And I know it's stuff I can do, like take castor oil, for example. Not right now, because I'm only, what am I? I just turned 37 weeks on, like, Friday. Friday. Yeah. So I'm I'm not going to do nothing until at least 38, so that's just one more week. But I'll be bouncing on my ball just to get her in the right position, and I walk. I want to try to do it natural as possible, but if I get to the point where she's like, look, <laughs> look, I might have to take that castor oil. But they say it's dangerous because the baby can, like, poop in you, and then if they, like, inhale it, I think it's bad. But... I know somebody who that happened to and she her baby's fine so but I see also a lot of people on YouTube taking castor oil and their babies be fine but I wouldn't take it too early like I wouldn't take it right now I just say don't take it at all he said don't take it at all but he's not pregnant and he, his back don't hurt and he's not um who back don't hurt he's not Shut because your back only hurts because the bed is messed up, not because you are carrying around a whole nother pounds of sh shit in your stomach and it's crushing your ribs. Ugh, y'all. This this neighborhood filled with cats. No prints. Come on. Nothing that's hungry. Right. That cat looked like a savage too. Like that cat. Oh. He looked up at Prince. I wonder if we got a cat with Prince. With Prince care. Yeah. Like, no, like, would he be friendly or would he be trying to bite it? He'd probably be friendly. But he too rough, like. Yeah. 
He like playing with things though. That's why he keep crying to get to it and stuff. He a big baby, y'all. Tell me, somebody tell me when they dog stop peeing in the house. Cause this little dude pees in the house. And I mean, we got him kind of late. We started potty training him at like four months. But still, I'm tired of it. Right. Cause at first he was just at Uncle Bill's in a cage, living his best life, just peeing anywhere Poop, he wanted. Pooping and peeing in the cage. And they would come and clean it up. So now, here he is, four months later, inside of a house, and he don't understand yet. Yeah, he still don't get it. Like, when he has to, like, pee pee, he will, or when he has to, like, poop, poop for real, for real, he'll go to his little box where his leash is and then go to the door and then run to his cage. That's how we know he even wants to go out. Right. But when he's just, like... Does his little spurts of peas? He just do it. I'm like, what is that for? Let's walk. Through. Did he poop? Yeah. Let's walk around again. But yeah, what was I even talking about before we, that cat interrupted? I don't even know. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know, cause my back started hurting. <laughs> we was talking about back pain. Yes, you don't get it, and you don't have feet in your ribs. You feel me? So you guys, don't have like, a head Ashley, pushing down on your bladder. So guys, Ashley literally, like this morning, she literally took her knuckle and started pushing it in my rib trying to get me to feel what it feels like. <laughs> Cause I just want him to feel my pain. Like I know girls have been getting pregnant for years, but I just wish they would come up with something to get dudes pregnant so they know how it feels. Because it's not easy. Like. No, mind you guys, my pregnancy was easy. The first semester, no problems. The second semester, I was just tired and stuff, but no problems. Dang, all these cats are out. It's dang, meal time. But yeah, second trimester, no problems. This trimester, my back just started killing me. Like, my bladder, I had to pee every five seconds, which that doesn't bother me anymore. The fact that I had to pee, <laughs> just eating them. The fact that I had to pee don't bother me no more because I'm used to it. Like I'm used to waking up in the middle of the night. Like I just, I just get up, and I know I'm gonna go back to sleep. Cut it out. And then, um, what else? I just be peeing on myself, like out of nowhere. She definitely just pees on herself. Like it's not even my fault. Like I just. Stop. I could easily go to the bathroom and then 10 minutes later, five minutes later, come back and then, it's not even like I have the opportunity to hold it. It just comes out. I'm just like, well, there goes that set of underwear again. Like I literally change my underwear like five times a day. That's too much information. <laughs> anyway, what other problems do I have? Uh, what about start? <laughs> just play. <laughs> Whatever. But yeah, I can't, I can't stand up for long. Well, now I can. During my second trimester, I couldn't stand up for long. Now I'm a little bit better. Like I can wash the dishes a little bit longer. Um, but yeah, I can't breathe, especially when I lay down. When I first lay down, I can't breathe. But I think, I think the baby's starting to drop lower. So my breathing is getting easier for me to breathe now. And it's, um, and when I eat, I used to get real full. And it's getting easier for me to um, eat now. Did I already upload the third trimester video? I don't know. I gotta check. I don't remember. I don't I need to get on editing and stuff. Oh, you know what video we're supposed to film? The pacifier. I mean, the bottle. Yeah. Bottle juice. We can do that when we get home. Yeah. So we got another uh, video for you guys. It's going to be a challenge video. I already no, I'm gonna win. Yeah, right. Well, probably because what it is. Say hey, Kalea. See, this is gonna be me. This is gonna be my new life. It's me and the baby. And she can't gonna... face like that until she's like. I know. Until she's like four months, probably. Yeah. But it's okay. I'm just practicing both ways. Yep. It's me and the baby. That's how it's gonna be. Oh, boy, had a poop now. Huh? You wearing this, it makes me want to think I do want to keep the other one. So you wore yours? Yeah. <laughs> it's a fence right there. And also, um, just in case you get it sweaty, 
I mean, mm. we're going to have to wash them. Yeah. But, oh, and that's another thing. Like, we can wash one and have one, you know. Yeah. You think we should keep both of them? Yeah. Now them. that I say that, yeah. Because mm. yeah. I think that's something we both really wanted as a gift. Mm. And we're both going to use it. She didn't really want one. Yes, I. I'm I really, put really it on the registry. Because it's me, because I wanted it. No, so you put it on for me. no. I wanted one. Get your head. <laughs> See, that's how he broke the last one. That one over there? No, right there. Before they put the green stuff right there. Yeah. Oh, Sounds he broke good. that before they put the green stuff? Yeah. Oh, I thought it, he got through the one down there. He be uh, sticking his head through the gate hole. Told you all this apartment janky, y'all. They I mean they did it's nice. They tried to gate. give us a, a dog park, but yeah. That but instead part. of getting a new gate, that's what they did. Right. Yeah. It's so much that I want them to do to this neighborhood, but I don't. I don't really care. Ooh, the fireflies are out. But I don't really care because we're not about to be here that long. So where we at now? It's just a temporary spot. I mean, well, when is our lease even up? Is our it up lease in is March? Up in January. No, cause no, because we did a fifteen months. So we yeah. did fifteen. Yeah, so it will be January, March. February, March, April. April. Oh, Shucks. well. Yeah. Hopefully, we'll be moving. It's better to move it when it's a little warmer too. Right, April it should just be like rain, like and cool. Stuff. Yeah, like yeah. probably seventy degrees. Like. Yeah, I'd rather move in April than what we did in. Because when we January. moved in January, it was cold. Like. We was moving stuff one by one, like little by little. We didn't have to move no furniture because we didn't have no furniture. So they just brought it all in the house. But now we got furniture and we got heli stuff. No. It's going to be a bitch moving all this stuff. It's going to be annoying. I, I told, listen, I told Cashley when we moved, because now our next spot, we're moving into a house. Now we're going, we're not going to get our own. We're going to rent. Not yeah, I want to rent a house because I don't know all the stuff that goes into a house and I don't want to buy a house without knowing all the stuff that goes into it and then be like feeling stuck with this house. Right. So we're so. going so to rent our next place. We're going to rent a home and I am not moving a dying thing. Okay. I'm getting a moving company and they're going to move it all. Because after this stuff that all this little girl just got, I'm not moving all this. Yeah, no. it's a lot. And on top of what her mama got, I'm not moving all of this. And no. I got a lot of stuff. But I, I'm trying to get rid of stuff. I might get rid of stuff this week again. I just went through all my stuff. But I'm going to go through it again because it's a lot of stuff that I don't use. But I just have, like, I feel like I need to keep it. Like, I'm a hoarder. I think that's so. me. Because I got a lot. I, me, personally... And you guys are probably gonna talk about me, but who cares? I'll literally wear the same thing over every and over. day. I don't change. Like I pretty much wear the same three outfits. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, I just but choked. He I has outfit. more, oh, yeah. but he just we just we're kind of like the same. Like I literally wear leggings and a t-shirt every day or a sweatshirt. Literally, this is the first time I wore something different in like See? in like in forever, right? five weeks or something. And me, I'm just track pants and. Go type of guy. Like, I got hella jeans and all that, but I refuse to put them on. Yeah. I just throw some track pants on. We just be tired, and we don't be going nowhere, so it's like, what's the point of dressing up? And I want to dress up, and I want to look nice, and I do got a little swaggy swag, I think, but... I mean, from Instagram, you might not think I got a lot of style, but y'all can see the potential, you feel me? So, we're back in the building, which means we're out of here, but like he said, go follow us on our social medias. They'll be on the screen. It's your girl, Cash. It's your boy, Donald.